Well, if you've been cribbing about the high prices of everyday items, it's not your imagination. India's wholesale price index rose 4.78% in November from a year ago. And hold your breath, the food price index rose an annual 16.7% in November from a year earlier. Sapna Das brings us the story of India's rising inflation and tells you if this government has a response, any response at all. Rising prices of food articles and food products is coming back to haunt India's policy makers again. Inflation for November clocked 4.78%, higher than market expectations of 4% levels. And this has primarily been spurred by high food inflation. The index for food articles in November has risen by 3.2% compared to the previous month, while the index for food products is also sharply up by 4.7%. Acknowledging this, Finance Minister Pranab Mukherjee told NDTV, food prices are a big worry area for the government. In every CPI, whether it is for industrial workers or it is for the rural level, the food items and primary items have the very high price, high weighting, particularly the food items, very higher weighting, so naturally it will be up and it is a matter of concern. On expected lines, price of vegetables like potatoes and onions, commodities like sugar and cereals like pulses take the lion's share in the upsurge in prices. During the past nine months, prices of pulses have shot up by over 32%. Vegetables as a group have become more expensive by 65% and potatoes are costlier by a whopping 140%, while sugar prices have gone up by over 37%. But Finance Secretary Ashok Chawla feels a problem could be explained via the base effect. Uh, the fact that food inflation was high and that it would reflect in the wholesale price index was also low. Yeah. Yeah. So it's not entirely um, something which has taken us by surprise. But we need to watch further and uh, see whether this is purely due to uh, the base effect. Now all eyes are on the RBI reaction to the figures and whether the growing food prices will come in the way of the RBI as it looks towards finalizing its exit from the stimulus measures. In New Delhi, with Sapna Das, Devdatta Das, NDTV Profit. Tuba .com.